call you back when I get out of here. Yeah, yeah. my music loud and I can barely hear. Yeah. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing my school morning routine. It's currently 5:30 right now. This is the time I wake up every day, even if I don't go to school, because my niece and nephew get dropped off and I take them in the morning. I look so dead and I'm using my phone for some light, but I'm just waiting for them to come. They usually get here by like 5.40, but I woke up like 10 extra minutes so I can do this and actually get up. I'm so tired. I probably won't film when they get here because they're going to go straight to sleep. Um, but I don't wake up until 6.50 or 7, so I'll just refilm again when I wake up again because we do go back to sleep. Good morning again. <laughs> it's 7 o'clock now and at this time, oh my goodness, my lashes are looking crazy. I'm getting them removed tomorrow, so just ignore that. I'm squatting right now because it's the only way you'll see me. But right now, I just like splash my face with water honestly and I brush my teeth and then I wake up the kids and then get them ready and I don't really get ready yet until I come back but yeah so so right now literally all I do to get ready is brush my hair out and put some tea tree oil on my pimple I don't do this every day but I popped it and now it's like super red so hopefully it'll calm down The TV's on, so I'm sorry you can't hear me, but it's 7.45 now, so at this time, we do start going downstairs, and then I turn off my car, and then we, like, I put them in their seat, so, yeah. So, I'm back home. It is 8.52 right now. Um, I need to get ready really, really fast. Connected my curling iron. It's so dirty. It's so gross. I know. It's like really old, but I don't curl my hair every day, but I want to curl it today. And also I just put on the shirt I'm going to wear today. And today is my almost last day of school. It's not because everyone's like in their finals week this week, but I still have this week and next week. I've been wanting to do this video for so long, but I don't know why I kept forgetting or like just not doing it, but now that the semester's almost over, I was like, I have to do it because I have literally two days left of school. Or not two days, but you know what I mean. So it's almost the end of my first semester, which is very crazy. Like, it went by so quick, I feel like it's insane. But I'm very excited. It honestly went pretty good. Like, I thought I'm ending, like, all my finals, I think, are pretty easy. So I'm almost done so excited literally don't even know what we're gonna do today in class like i feel like we can have our finals week this week because i don't like all my online classes we're not doing anything anymore like she already gave us our study guide i haven't got one for sociology i don't think he's gonna give us one he does things weird but i don't know like literally i feel like this week is just like pointless and like a filler week but it's fine i'm literally doing my hair so fast i was gonna curl it last night but it was still wet and i really didn't want to blow dry it and i was tired and i just wanted to go to sleep so i didn't do it last night but here i am after i finish my first class i don't go home but i have like a three four hour gap in there so i just eat something because i don't bring lunch because i just i don't want to Maybe next semester because I do have another gap next semester, which I really try to avoid. But 
Ugh, that was a hassle having to register for classes again i hated it worst experience ever so stressful and i get so anxious and every class i want like i'm ready to get gets filled up before my like registration time so it's not great also i'm filming another video later today like i'm filming two videos today so if you see me in the same outfit that's why i don't know which one's going up first i kind of want to get this one up first but my ac went off my ac my heater went off so yeah if you see me literally in the same outfit in two videos straight that's why the only thing i'm not excited about is when the new semester starts and parking gets bad again right now parking's not as bad i don't know if anyone saw my chick-fil-a mukbang i was talking about how much i hate it i still hate it it's still bad i still have to like wait and like you know but it's not as bad as it was before like it's i don't have to wait like two hours to find a parking spot well it's probably because people aren't coming to class anymore <laughs> Like at the beginning of the year, that everyone's like, oh my god, I have to go to class. So at the beginning of the semester, it's going to be like that again. And I'm not excited. I'm not looking forward to it. I'm going to go with my sponge and then I'll be right back. I had white crusty stuff all over my lips and I didn't even notice. I feel like I haven't filmed a video in so long. And I'm very excited to like be motivated again to make videos. I just got like really dismotivated because I didn't know what I want to do. Because I thought about it like I don't have to have like one set thing that I want to do. So like I'm just going to do whatever because I miss editing. I know it's super weird but I love editing videos. I love setting it up and like talking because I talk so much so like when i film a video it's like my time to be like you know what i mean i totally just forgot to put on moisturizer oh my goodness i'm gonna put moisturizer on half my face you can hear that it's like the police academy training and they're like running down the street anyways um i got what i'm saying something about like that it doesn't matter what i film so now i'm like motivated again i like doing like get ready with me but i can't just do that you know and i also like doing vlogs and i don't know but sometimes like i feel like my life's not interesting okay anymore because i want to look back on these that's literally the reason why i did it to begin with because i have so many videos on private that i would vlog just so like i can have like a memory of it and I kind of stopped doing that and I want to do that again. Also, very exciting. I'm going to be dyeing my hair super soon. I don't know if I'm going to go somewhere, if I'm going to do it myself. I always dye my hair. Oh my gosh, I just got that all over my hair. I always dye my hair myself, but I'm kind of scared and I kind of just want to do it like one last time and have someone do it just so I don't have to worry about it ever again. But... I don't know i kind of want to do it myself and if i do it myself i can make a video on it i mean even if i don't do it myself i think i'm gonna film it i'm gonna do it di <laughs> i'm doing it before before christmas so but i want to do it after i end school because i don't want to just randomly show up with like a different hair color but i'm waiting until i finish my until i finish this semester but also i want to do it before christmas or, I don't know. It doesn't have to be before Christmas, but I want it to be. But I'm excited because I'm tired of this blonde. Like, I like it, honestly. And I would keep it if my hair wasn't so damaged. Like, my hair... I'm going bald. I'm I'm going bald. I'm not even gonna lie. And I just want to let my hair grow long. Or, I don't know. I'm in between once I dye my hair if I want to cut it. Because, obviously... I don't know if you can tell, but everything is dead. The, like, crown of my head is so dead. I'm, like, there's, like, pieces of hair that are, like, this long. It's, like, horrible. I hate it. But that's what I get for doing my hair myself. But even then, I think it's kind of, like, unavoidable because of how much I've bleached my hair to, like, get this color. But I don't know. I think dyeing my hair would just make my hair look healthier kind of want to leave it a surprise to see what I dye it as even though you can probably guess what it's gonna be I'm just ready 
for a change i guess i know i'm probably gonna want to go back to blonde but once i let like my hair get healthier then i can do that because i can't really let my hair breathe or get healthy if i keep it blonde because at some point i'm gonna have to retouch it and then i'm going to keep using like toners to keep like everything looking fresh or whatever and i'm really lazy when it comes to like doing hair treatments and stuff so i know it's my fault it's not the blonde's fault well it's both i want to have to keep up with it so much so yeah i do have eyelash extensions you can probably tell already but i am getting them removed i just want them to breathe a little bit because even though like i don't think they're that damaging to your natural lash well we're gonna find out tomorrow if they're that damaging i like them they have made my life easier but i i just hate keeping up with them i have to go like every two weeks which as you can see after two weeks they look kind of rough if i'm not like literally living with my spoolie and if i brush them like they still look like spidery and not the best so i just want to get them removed oh my god what? they're literally going like this now that i'm basically ready i'm gonna get ready really quick and then i'll be back i'm eating cereal now <laughs> because there's nothing else and i really don't want to make anything but i'm eating cocoa pebbles which is my favorite cereal I'm just going to finish eating my cereal and then get like my back my backpack and stuff ready and then start leaving sorry i just did that with my eyes so gross ignore the huge mess i have everywhere but this is my outfit let me take off my backpack um i'm wearing this black shirt that i already showed you guys it's a frank ocean shirt i kind of forgot where i got it the store i found was on twitter and it's either called like blonde shop or blonded shop whichever one it is i'll put it right here and then i'm just wearing this jean jacket my black jean jacket that i wear like every day from guess i'm wearing these pants are celebrity pink and then my forever 21 belt and i'm just wearing my air force ones so it's a simple outfit today i really didn't have anything to wear honestly back up here i literally have you guys on a bunch of shoe boxes it's 9 35 i usually leave at 9 30 or 9 40 the latest so i'm okay on time we'll see you guys when i get into the car in like five seconds I'm on my way to school now. Um, sorry if this is shaky. My phone's like, doesn't really fit that great on this tripod. And I'm charging my other camera. Because like for the thousandth time, I have said that I am filming later. So I'm charging that camera. It says I'm going to be at school. It's like a 25 minute drive, it said. I'm very excited. Today I'm putting on my tail lights on my car. And that's what I'm filming, by the way. I don't even think I said what I'm filming. But I am putting on my tail lights on my car, and I'm so excited. I've had them for like a week, and I still haven't put them on. It's just like it's been like raining, and and I did want to film it, so I was like, mm, I'm gonna do it like in between my four-hour break. That's more than enough time. That's what I did when I put my exhaust on. I literally did it in that time frame from my break and it worked out and I feel like an exhaust is more complicated than taillights so. so I'm just rambling on so yeah I'll probably just give you guys an update when I get to school or when I'm around school because it's gonna be a lot to film if I just film the whole way there Guys, I freaking jinx myself. I was like, yeah, like parking is so much better. I still haven't found a parking spot. It's 1020. I mean, I'm fine. My class doesn't start until 1130, but I start leaving at 11, which I have 40 minutes. I'm bound to find one, but I don't know why it's so packed today. It hasn't been like this in forever, like probably a month. It hasn't been like this. And now like all of a sudden it's like, in case anyone wanted to know, I have not found parking yet. It's 10.42. I have 20 minutes still. It's 10.43. I have like less than 20 minutes still to find a parking. But everyone that keeps coming out of here is not leaving. Guys, I found a parking. It's literally 
11 o'clock the time I get off of my car to go to class I was I was like if I don't find a parking by 11 10 was the latest I would have like given myself I am not going to class even though I need to go because I need to turn something in so I'm just giving myself a breather. I literally was so stressed out. I've never let it get this close. I'm gonna end it here. It's basically my morning routine and then I just, I get out of class, I got one. So I hope you guys enjoyed my little morning routine that I do for school and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.